vlog number 21. <laughs> Not sponsored by, but stay hydrated. <laughs> we just finished the warm up, one and a half miles, and now we're gonna uh, just start stretching. Just stretch it out, stay warm, stay, stay heated up. We're gonna get these 400s out, stretch. Yeah, man, feeling good out here. It's, it's nice and humid. I don't know with the, with the good weather, but it's humid out here, so. Gotta get the water and stretching in. And I've got these 400. Hey, it's almost that time. It's almost that time. All right, all right, so fam. So we just finished up the warm up. One and a half miles. Been at a good, good side of pace. Got some stretching in. Time to do our little mini uh, workout. Just two four hundred, but gonna get after them. Get, yeah. get them done. What do you say a one one thirty pace on yeah. each? Probably on the average, try to yep between 130 and 135 just to get the legs uh, used to that pace. That's about six flat pace for a, a mile. So you know we're trying to get get to you know improving times. If y'all been keeping up with us, you know y'all what times we ran uh, the first race. So. We kind of know what we uh, what we were at for those times and what they broke down to as far as the average mile. But right now, trying to increase that pace. We was out here last month and we ran pretty well out here, so got to carry that over. All right, we're gonna get into this 400. So we just did our 400s. Got enough, uh, both knocked out. Went about, about 120, about 120 pace for each one. That's about like five, five minutes and 10 seconds a mile average. Okay. Just about the thing is here. A 530 something. Five, 530, 540. 120 is five on now. So yeah, we did like 120 around for, for the 400 that equals out to about five five minute uh, mile so feel good mm -hmm. recovery time was pretty quick uh yeah just was able to talk right after and so all those miles we put in prior especially like uh two weeks ago we were doing like six 
six, seven, seven, then the eight on the weekend. So like all that's helping with like, recovery. So yeah, man, we've been putting in this work, been out here grinding every single week, just hammering it out, layering, uh, layering on the workouts. And it's gonna show, it's gonna pay off for us at this race, man. We're gonna cash out. Uh, you know these on these miles yeah. that we've been putting in the mile bank. It's coming Monday. Yeah, and also like, cause I get a lot of people asking these questions about how often we run, and we run every day during the week separately. So it's like we're doing this on our own accord. So that's the discipline portion of it. Like I already know Keith gonna hit his workout. You know, and Keith knows I'm gonna hit my workout. We get the notifications. So that keeps us like in sync with our workouts during the week when we're not together on the weekends, but we get together on the weekends and race days to actually, you know, do some heavy training or preparation for these type of events. Yep. And that's like pretty much how that goes down. So find you a buddy system, you know, find you somebody else that or join along with the River City Runners and you'll see us hitting it every day to help you motivate yourself to get out there and put some work in too so you know find if, if, if not find somebody that you can feed off of that's also trying to get consistent and y'all use each other yep and, and it, it helps you uh holds you accountable and keeps you on your game on your, uh on top of your game and man you know when you got somebody that you can uh work out with and push you to the next level y'all both get better so that's another thing to keep in mind again i say y'all come out here and run with us i mean you know, however y'all want to do it, but you got to make sure you're doing something to get in shape out here and stay on it. Stay on it. Yeah, yeah that's our, our workout, the main workout. We did the meat and the potatoes, and now it's time to get to the desserts, which is our uh, one mile cool down or warm down. So we're going to go ahead and knock that out, and then we're going to close it out with you guys and uh, catch up with y'all on that part. Yo. Guys, we just finished our one mile warm warm down. That's pretty much the workout for today. Yep, nice and nice and uh, smooth. Got a quick pace in, not too much though, so we can recover fast over this weekend and just get ready for for this second race of 2022. Yeah, got the Memorial Day 5K coming up. It's gonna be an interesting one, just to see the progression and growth and see where we're at now uh, then and compare that to our previous race and really see how the work has paid off you know it's important to, to have those benchmarks so you can see your progression because that keeps you motivated yeah, man, we've, been, we've been putting in a lot of work so you can't can't wait to get out there and get in that atmosphere in that in that zone again and just bask in that you know in that ambiance of, of runners different runners from different paths and, See where we rank. See where we see where we stack up. Yeah, it's a, it's a huge competition. So like, that's just that's the fun part about it. Just you know, seeing where you where you rank amongst the rest. And like the, the scariest thing is those 55 year old men running these 16s and 15s. I, I you know, yeah, we coming for them. Oh yeah, it's gonna be some years, but we on their heads too. So. We coming for. Them. And like man, this is a USA Track and Field certified course, so. It's gonna be a little bit faster than the last one we ran on. Uh, Florida Stratus is putting this one on, so we're gonna definitely see what this one's about. I ran in this one personally uh, some years back, but that's that was years ago, so let's see what we at right now. Yeah, and this is my first time running this course, so we'll, we'll, I just wanna do better than I did last race and sure. keep showing progress each time. That's it. Sure. You know, thank you guys for watching wall number 21. Racking up the vlogs, um, you know, keep up with the content. We got more health and fitness tips coming. We got more shoe reviews on the way as well. So just, you know, be on the lookout for that. And, you know, show us some love on Instagram at River City Runners 904. Um, you can also find us on Facebook too at River City Runners. So go ahead and subscribe and follow all the pages, channels, and keep up with me and Keith. And stay tuned for race vlog number two.